and the flow of blood from the eye of Chad Bennett. Great sportsmanship, it's been fought, good spirit. That is a huge cut over the right eye of Chad Bennett. It is very wide, very deep. More water. You got the mouth guard, Mick. Okay, let's see if we can identify what has happened here. This is round number five. Head clash. Yeah, it was a head clash. They just both leaned in at the same time. Fuck. Chad Bennett also marked underneath the other eye. So issues on both sides. No vision issues though, most importantly for Chad. It is a bad cut, Andy, but if yeah. the fight was stopped because of it, I don't know if it's going to help the Jesus, because they're going to go to the cards, and at this stage you would think Chad Bennett's going to win. Most certainly. That's not the way Chad Bennett wants to win, though. No, he wants to win. By knockout, it's like any fight. But for the Jesus' point of view, it, he probably really needs this fight to go the distance and do our box. Chad, try and pick some rounds up here, get some confidence, but we haven't seen the punching power that you would think could stop Chad from knockout. That was nice from Bennett. Oh, crippling body shot. And Bennett has accelerated his aggression a little bit here. Oh. And down. That's it. Wellington to Jesus. Will he get to his feet? a brutal body shot Andy a brutal body shot and a question mark don't try and question this decision the he's gone the corner saying the corner saying he didn't understand it was to 10 Sadly, Lee, that leaves a very bitter taste in my mouth. Well, that's what he said. Whether that's what the, the true... Wellington had had enough, mate. No mistake about that. There was a couple of body shots there. He wanted no more of Chad Hollywood Bennett. KO in round number five for Hollywood. And Wellington to Jesus dancing up a storm here. What about these left hands from Bennett? The Let's body shots this were so quick. Ladies and gentlemen, now bringing our fighters into the That was one. And he comes back for a little bit more. Ladies and gentlemen, oh. in round number five, one minute and eight seconds in. The fight being stopped. Just waiting for the official announcement. Jay Bennett just getting the gloves off. His hand to be raised in victory. As we said, ladies and gentlemen, one minute and eight seconds into round number five, your winner from the blue corner, Hollywood. Chad Hollywood Bennett, a knockout victor in round number five over Wellington to Jesus. May not be back in Australia for some time. I don't know if the promoter's going to fork out to have Wellington back after an indifferent display on the count. Let's go send a ring to Rick Powell, who's got Chad with him. Chad. Chad, just a couple of words with him. Chad, first of all, congratulations, well done. Five rounds of fairly tough sort of action here. A bad cut over the eye. 
Thought it might have led to a stoppage, an accidental headbutt. Yeah, mate, it was uh, five pretty good rounds, actually. Uh, being a southpaw, uh, I haven't got a lot of experience with southpaws, and I, it was pretty awkward. We hit heads a few times. And uh, he's got a pretty hard nugget, so, uh, yeah, I got opened up on the eye, and that's boxing here to go on with it. OK, well, of course, that's obviously a, a good bout for you to have at this point after the, uh, the loss you had last time around. There is talk of a rematch, I understand, with that? Yeah, definitely. I'm looking for a rematch with Sir Moncal Samantha, who uh, humiliated me in front of me, family and friends and supporters. Um, I really want to get the rematch and try and square the ledger. But we wanted a hard fight tonight to do that, so uh, I would have liked it to have gone the distance, but that's boxing, and I'm happy with the work that I got under my belt tonight. Were you a little disappointed the way this fight ended tonight? Yeah, I was. I, I was I'd be lying if I said that I wasn't. Uh, I mean, I knew the body shot hit him flush and it hurt him. But, I mean, if you want to lay around on the canvas, you're going to get counted out. If you want to hop up, you've got 10 seconds to get up. So, uh, he didn't want to be here. Simple as that. Good on you, Chapel. Congratulations. Well done. It's good to see you back. What's, what's perhaps next for you after this point? What's that, mate? What's, what's next for you at this point in time? Mate, uh... I don't know, I'll probably go back to work tomorrow at Newcastle, Steve Adores, probably feel the boys out of night. And, uh, yeah, mate, we'll just wait and see what happens. We're booked in to fight here on November 21. And uh, I'd just like to take this opportunity to thank all my sponsors, Dean Marv, A-Team Scaffolding. Thank you, mate. Jimmy Smith, Frontline. Gary Shepherd, Bass Flooring. Your good mate, Peter Garrow from the Pro Contractor Group. Thanks, mate. Robinson Property. Mate, there's so many people I've, I've got to thank. Uh, special guest tonight, Sharky Raymond up there in the audience. It's a pleasure to fight in front of Sharky. Uh, family and friends, my daughter Ashley, my nephew Joel, niece Marley, everyone. Just uh, my trainer, Artie Armstrong, all the help, Ian Batty. Just so many people to thank. It's been a pretty hard slog to get me here, so thank you everybody. Thank you, Chad. Congratulations. Well done. We'll see you again soon. A very thank happy you. Chad Bennett there. Thank your sponsors and those that have made it possible.